Do you wonder where to find your best qualified leads every single day? Let's be honest, it can be completely overwhelming to find the people who want what you have to offer to resolve this, their problem, right? Well, this is why in this episode number 104, I'm going to share with you where your best qualified leads are hanging out so you can be in that fishing pole at all times. So, stay tuned. <laughs> Hey, hey, Thierry here from thierryvalexander.com. I help makeup artists, network marketers, and entrepreneurs create an effective presence online so you never have to run out of leads ever again. If you're new here, consider subscribing because each and every week I do create a new video training and also I attach a PDF of some sort, a guide, cheat sheet, that you can download to be empowered in your own way within your business. In this episode number 104, I'm going to share with you the simple way on where you can find people to talk to and never run out of leads ever again. And that one strategy is all on Facebook, Facebook groups to be even more precise. This is the place where you can find all the fishing poles of leads, of best qualified leads that are wanting what you have to offer already. Now, you want to make sure, however, to preserve your energy, your time and money as well when going into those groups. The way I go about it, the way I teach my clients to, to prospect and connect on Facebook groups is by picking two to maximum five Facebook groups where they're going to hang out in and give value, engage, connect with people. So let's dive into the three type of Facebook groups that you can go find and engage to get all the best qualified leads for your business products and service. So the first group that I recommend my clients to get into is a product type of Facebook group where people are already demanding or actually I would say needing or using your product already. So for example, people that have joints and skin problem, they can actually use the collagen that I'm recommending from my, from my business. If I go into a group where they are already using collagen and they love that, they already talk about this, then that is a great group where I can have conversation with people. Furthermore, I would actually, it is an even better way to be in a group where people have a problem that you can solve with your product. So you can be in a group where I would say in my example that people have problems with skin, joints problem, back problem, yet they don't know exactly what to use or they are not necessarily aware about collagen. So I'll be in that group engaging with people, friending them up and get them into my messenger box. We can converse further. I give them some tips and introduce them to my product that can solve their problem. You just need to show that you are the bridge between the problem they've got and the solution that you have. And as you know, each and every single week, I also come up with a freebie of some sort, a cheat sheet, a guide for you to be empowered in your own way, in your business. This week, because we're talking about prospecting, finding your best qualified leads, it is also important to have content, to share value, tips, etc. So I brought a, a guide, which is my 15 social media content guide, that is there to help you to never run out of content ideas. So when people are coming on your profile, they can see that you are a, prof a value provider and they are wanting, they are going to want to connect with you even further. So if you want to have access to my 15 social media content idea guide, you can click the yellow button below this video and that will be sent automatically to your email box. If you are on my YouTube channel or any other platforms watching this video, just go into the description section. There will be a link taking you back to my blog. And again, below this video, you'll see a massive yellow button you cannot miss at all. Once you click it, you will receive my 15 social media ideas guide in your email box. The second group that I recommend my clients to get into is an opportunity type of groups. 
What I mean by this is a group where people are in need or already interested into your type of opportunity. You might want to find an entrepreneur group where you can mingle around, connect with people and offer your solution, your opportunity, wherever it is applicable. However, do not spam your opportunity all over the group. You're going to be booted out anyway if you do that. Just connect with people, find out their problems, and then you reach out to them in Messenger Box. You connect on a private basis. For example, makeup artists. If I'm in a makeup group and people are, you know, most makeup artists are having difficulties to uh, make ends meet, like month ends meet together. So my opportunity of having an extra income stream might be appealing to them. I will have conversations, friend them up, get even more personal in Messenger and then offer them my opportunity wherever it, it fits, right? And up to them to decide whether it is something they want to take on board or not but it is really not in the group that I am going to blaster about my opportunity and tell people to join me in all this. This is really not uh, sexy at all. You want to have true, meaningful conversation and be someone of value. And the third and final group, but far from being the least, that people tend to forget about, they don't even think about it at all, it is called an interest group. A group where it is all about the interest that you have. What, what other things outside of your business do you like talking about for hours on end and you could you know, have a conversation about all the time, each and every single day? Like knitting, maybe TV shows, perhaps a sports of some sort, travel, poetry. What are your passions? What do you love? What is it that you are really excited to talk about on a regular basis? This is the exact group that you want to join. There's Facebook groups for everything, everything that you are loving, wanting to talk about or wanting to do. You know, maybe hiking is one of those things that you like doing. That's something that I quite like and I'm part of some groups of, of those as well. So find those groups and again, connect with people, make connections. The reason those groups are important is because you will be naturally interested in connecting with people in those groups. So in conclusion, you just need to find three groups, a product group, an opportunity group and an interest type of group. Those groups you spend about seven to 10 minutes in each of them per day, each and every single day to connect and prospect with people. That's why I'm saying maybe three is the maximum in my opinion, up to five, but you want to spend 10 to say seven to 10 minutes in each of those groups. You then connect transition the conversation into Messenger and offer your opportunity or your product wherever and whenever it is adaptable and it is the, the right time to do it, right? So that's all for today. That's what I wanted to share. This is a great, great strategy. This is the best places to find people to talk to on a regular basis and never run out of people. If you make a great post, you can get a lot of engagement and go on for days and days and days with those leads within that post of yours. Did you get value out of this video training? I truly hope that you did. If you did, of course, you can smash the share button, send it to your fellow network marketers, entrepreneurs, makeup artists, whomever you think could benefit from having leads in their business. This is something they need to know. They must be aware of this. And remember, I also have your bag with my 15 social media ideas guides. If you want to have access to this guide, you can click the yellow button below this video and that will be sent automatically to your email box. Question of the week. Who is your ideal customer? Share with me in the comment section, who is it that you would like to serve? Who is it that you'd like to share your opportunity 
or your product to service with? What type of people are they? Women, men, younger generation, elderly, something somewhere in between? Who are they? What they do? What do they do? I, I'd like to know if you don't know who is your ideal audience and how to figure out who is your best audience, please let me know as well. I can always help you out with this. But share with me, inspire me, and thank you so much for tuning in, connecting each and every single week. It's a pleasure to connect with you. This video training is a wrap, but I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye-bye.